Hey, it's Kevin. Welcome back to the Road Warrior. Second week in a row, we've been hit with highway traffic. I actually take some of the, kind of the same highways each and every week when I do the Road Warriors, just in and out, you know, kind of the outer, outer end, and because Nashville traffic is getting so bad, popped popped again for the second week in a row. Ha, what it is. Um, last week, I was talking about how I, I, I was falling apart, how that when we all turn 60, we all just start falling apart, at least that's what the doctors tell us. Funny that, and then I got to thinking, well, how come when we're younger, we bounce back so quickly from all those colds and flus? Over the course of the last month or so, I've had three of my nephews come down. Well, one came down with strep, one came down with severe case of the flu, and I don't know what the third had. I know it was coming out of both ends, you know. Um, you know, We're talking ages 17, 16, and 6. Strep throat for my 16-year-old nephew, and they put... Theraflu, Tamiflu, some kind of flu, some medicine in him. He's back in school in three days. My other nephew, now he's a basketball player. Ooh, man, nice pothole. Uh, he's a basketball player, so he's in good shape. Um, felt the flu coming on, started running a, a, a little bit of a fever. They called him in some medication. He was cleared up in two days. I, I don't ever remember clearing up from the flu in two days when I was his age, let alone any age. Man, the flu always knocks me out for a good six or eight days. Anymore, a cold will knock me out for two weeks. And that's even when I go to the doctor and try to get something for it. The littlest one, I don't know how long he he, he was down for the count real bad for at least three or four days. And again, you know, when you're talking, you know, what, six, seven years old, how, how do you really know how well they're really feeling? You know, I, again, I don't remember those things. But I find it interesting, and I guess I'm fascinated with our human body and why it does what it does, and why it doesn't do what it doesn't do, and, and all those things in between. I'm surprised that they can do studies, and that, you know, it's all based around age. Sure, there's some other factors that play into it, things like that, but it's all based around age that really populates how, how well you're going to react to things. And I mentioned last, week's about, uh, last week about bruises, where when you get older, bruises don't heal as fast. And I, said, I wonder why that is. I know it's, it's, it's all about the elasticity, the elasticity of the skin and the circulation and all that kind of stuff, but it's just, it's just strange to me. And again, like I said, man, I remember being sick as a kid, and I don't ever remember anything just a quick turnaround in two days. I don't remember being a... I had a stomach virus that was misdiagnosed by a doctor. I was out of school for six weeks. You know, I mean, it just... I guess it's, uh, the, the key is having a good doctor. Having a doctor you can trust it has been part of my problem over the years. I've had a lot of doctors, very few I can trust, very few who are trustworthy. And I don't know why that is. You know, mi- missing medication, you know, forgetting to prescribe medications. Uh, one, prescribing medications we found out later I didn't need. Um, that's how he just built the government for money. And I know. I just shake my head sometimes and wonder, not about the fairness. I've had a good life and I'm having a good life, but... It's just kind of those things that make you go, hmm, I don't know. Back next week with another new Road Warrior, KevinMason.us, home to all of the Road Warrior videos. We also throw them up on YouTube, throw them up on Facebook. Again, like, comment, share, um, just tell a friend about it. Make fun of it, I don't care. Or, you know, or maybe it's something you guys can talk about, share, share amongst yourselves and let us know. You know, I, I just, again, I love it when you come on by. We're only bothering you once a week, and... And again, they're, those kind of things, are, they're not necessarily timely, so you don't have to really be there when they drop on Sunday nights. But we appreciate for those who are, and we appreciate you stopping by, no matter if this is five years down the road. Which is kind of hard to thank you for something that's actually five years down the road, but it's not five years yet, but you know what I mean. Back next week with the new Road Warrior. Thanks.